the producer of Pirates of the Caribbean 2 recognized Johnny Depp's influence when the film made $1.6 billion despite being a disaster test screening. We believed our professional lives were over. One of Hollywood's most well-known actors, Johnny Depp gained notoriety by consistently outperforming himself on and off the screen, even though he was accused of abusing his ex-wife Amber Heard. That is not the topic of this article. Depp's most well-known, significant, and lucrative role was that of Captain Jack Sparrow in the Pirates of the Caribbean film series, in which he appeared in all five installments as the lead character. Or was he the adversary? Due to Johnny Depp's odd acting, the franchise experienced many ups and downs while filming, but it persevered and is now a multi-billion dollar phenomenon. In the box office, Pirates of the Caribbean 2 almost failed. Due to Depp's hilarious performance as Captain Sparrow, the Pirates of the Caribbean film series has been a hugely successful and fun movie-producing franchise, and audiences have adored every minute of each and every one of the films. But all that we are aware of is the franchise's success, not the struggles it had to overcome to achieve that success. Producer of Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest Jerry Bruckheimer revealed in an interview with ABC News that they had severe opposition just weeks before the sequel's release. Only a few weeks remained until the film's premiere, and the producer revealed that the film was still being edited and that it was being trimmed down because it was too long. He also said that the film was a bit complicated for young viewers, said Bruckheimer. We had a movie that was close to 2 hours and 35 minutes, so we had to cut it down to a time when we felt the story worked, and I believe the movie is 2 hours and 7 minutes, plus credits. The kids thought it was a disaster. We prepared to cut off our wrists. We removed the alcohol. I'll tell you, we believed our professional lives were over. Although the film initially had several significant issues, it was successfully edited to a suitable length, earned many favorable reviews after being stitched up at the production house, and enjoyed a good run at the box office. The box office performance of Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest was extremely positive. The Gore Verbinski helmed Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, led by Johnny Depp's Captain Jack Sparrow, was a resounding hit, grossing more than $1 billion worldwide on a $225 million budget. Out of the five films that have been released so far, it was the second to be released back in 2006. Also, there are reports circulating that the sixth film script has been under development, and an official announcement is anticipated before the end of this year. The franchise has so far produced five films, and despite having an estimated $1.25 billion budget, those films have amassed a whopping $4.5 billion in box office receipts. The second film has also received numerous honors, including nominations for the Grammy Awards, the Critics' Choice Awards, the Academy Awards, the BAFTA Awards, the Golden Derby Awards, and countless more awards.